Hello everyone. Today we are going to do question 4 of exercise 12.3 class 6. The question goes like this. Cost of 5 kg of wheat is 91.5 rupees. That is 91 rupee and 50 paisa. That is for 5 kg of wheat. What will be the cost of 8 kgs of wheat? And one more question here. What quantity of wheat can be purchased in rupees 183? Okay. Today I am going to show you all a very simple trick when two parameters are given. See for example here. 5 kg of wheat is costing 91.5 rupees. So 8 kg of wheat will cost how much? That is the question. Now let us see how much it will cost. Now we will do it by cross multiplication. While doing cross multiplication, you have to be little careful with the parameters. Like I will write here kg and price that is cost. Okay. Now here they have given us for 5 kg. 5 kgs of wheat will cost us 91.5 rupees. 5 0 means that is 91.5 they both are equal. So 8 kg will cost how much? That is the question. What will be the cost of 8 kgs of wheat? So, you have to be always careful to write similar parameters one below the other. Like here, kg, 5 kg, 8 kg. I have written one below the other. Price, 91.5 and we do not know. So, let us take it as x. So, you have to be careful while writing the parameters that you write them Perfectly one below the other. No mixing up things here. So 5 kgs, 8 kgs, 91.5, how much? So you write it like this and do a cross multiplication. That is 5 into x is equal to 8 into 91.5. So cross things get multiplied. 5 into x, this is cross multiplication. The 5 is getting multiplied with x and 8 is getting multiplied with 91.5 so now we want x so 5 comes on the right hand side multiplication becomes division it is multiplication here it becomes division so 8 into 91.5 upon 5 now 5 ones are 5 5 ones are 5 4 is the remainder 5 eights are 40 1 is the remainder point remains as it is 5 threes are 15 so it is 18.3 into 8 8 into 18.3 divided by 1 is nothing but it is 8 into 18.3. So, if you are getting confused, you can divide it like this. 91.5 divided by 5. 5 ones are 5. 4. Pull down 1. 5 eights are 40. 1. We put a point. Pull down 5. 5 threes are 15. So, 18.3. Now we will multiply 8 into 18.3. 8 ones are 8, 8 ones, 16, 3 is equal to 8. 24, 8 times 8 is 64, 66. 8 ones are 8, 14. So it is 146.4. So we got answer as 146.4. So we write it as the cost of 8 kgs of wheat is equal to 146.40 that is 146 rupees and 40 pesa that is the first answer now let us see the b part of the same question that is they have told us cost of 5 kg of wheat is 91.5 what quantity of wheat can be purchased in rupees 183? So we do the same thing. So kg and rupees. So they have told us 5 kg of wheat is costing us 91.50. Now they have given us money here that is rupees they have told us 183 rupees if we give 183 rupees how many kgs of wheat can be purchased now let us cross multiply again now let us take this as x okay 
so we can write it as x into 91.50 is equal to 5 into 183 so x is equal to 5 into 183 divided by 91.5 91.50 i'm going to write it as only 91.5 so we start simplifying 5 ones are 5 ones are 5 5 eights are 40 5 3 is a 15 183 divided by 18.3 183 divided by 18.3 now when we take one decimal to the right hand side we can add one zero on top we do that 1830 divided by 183 because we are taking one decimal point right so 183.0 becomes 1830. So 1830 divided by 183. 183 times 1, 183 times 10. So 10 is the answer. So we can write as 10 kgs of wheat can be purchased in rupees 183 hope you like my video please like and subscribe my channel thank you